just checking because the other day I visited another studio in the BBC where nothing was quite as it seemed. There were characters that moved and spoke like humans but weren't. Walls that could change colour as quickly as a click on a computer mouse and props that moved about. No, not that one. Who said that? Me. Try this one over here. This one's real. Real? What do you mean by real? Well, you see, you and the sofa are the only things in this room that are actually there. The rest is just a trick of the light. <laughs> what? So does that mean you're not real either? Sure does. So, who am I talking to? Oh, you're talking to me. But if you're not real, how can I be talking to you? No, 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 no. Not me over here. Me over there. No, I mean, no, me over... No, no. Look, I'll tell you what. Come round here, I'll explain how it works. Come on, over here. OK. Come on. Mark Todd was the man who was going to make it all clear. Ah, oh, are, yeah. are you real? I certainly hope so. Oh, sorry. Uh, it's just because I met this man and he wasn't real and he's kind yeah. of real. He Strange guy, to me. white T-shirt, Australian accent. Yeah. Well, that's Mavis up to his old tricks. Oh, so tell me, how does it all work? Now, if you look at the set, you'll see that on the set all you have are two props, a table and a settee. Yeah. Now, all around the studio is a grey cloth. Now, the grey cloth is made up with very fine glass beads. It's the sort of thing that you find on policemen's outfits or on trainers that reflect light. Now, what they do is they reflect all the light which is shone at them straight back at you. Now, if you take a look here on the camera, you can see there's a ring of blue lights. Yeah, I noticed that. Yeah? Now, all of the blue light which is shone at the grey fabric comes straight back into the camera. So how does that make the image of the living room appear? Well, all of the blue light, plus all of the other information, then goes down the camera lens, down that long wire, into the gallery around the back, where all the magic happens. Right. OK? So now if you go and walk in front of the grey cloth... OK. ...anything that the camera sees which is blue, it replaces with a set. Oh. Yeah? Yeah. So you can now walk around the set and do anything okay. you want. So that's why on the monitor I can now see living room. That's right. And you can, can walk anywhere. You can sit down on the real sofa. So what I can't do, right, is sit on this sofa, correct? Oh, cos I end up on the floor like that. You just use the real furniture, right? Got you. You can't pull the curtains, then. Now, the camera over there, you can see, mm -hmm. it can move around, it can move up, it can move down. And wherever it can see blue, the computer out the back will put a piece of set. So I've magically got windows and a street opposite. It's amazing. Yep, even on my shirt if I walk into shop. There we are. You'll notice that the camera will begin to replace all of my information <gasps> with a piece of set. You've gone. Now, on the ceiling, you can see reflective circular barcodes. Yep. Now, this little camera here looks up at those barcodes, and if it can see four or more, mm -hmm. it can actually tell the computer in the gallery where this camera is on the set, so the computer can decipher which bit of set the camera is actually looking mm, at. Very clever. Got that? Got that, I think. So now I know how it all works. Can mm. I watch the rehearsal? Fine. Take a seat. I'll be back with you later. OK, cool. Watching the actors against the grey cloth was a bit confusing. I had to watch the picture on the monitor He's to the follow one. the drama. He's the one that was in the flat. He's the correct answer. You win again. You win that lovely uh, little toaster. Do you want to stick around for the tub and dry the washing machine and that beautiful holiday Marbella? Yeah, but he was also dread before. Round the corner, people were working to put the pictures and sound together. There are three computers. One runs the virtual actor and the other two are linked to the two cameras. Now the information comes from the cameras, goes through the computer and is then fed into the studio desk. Now this is where the pictures from the two cameras are put together to make the drama work. So what the director is looking at is the computer generated set together with the actors who are in the studio. Is that a real Jackson Pollock? Uh, no, let's just wear our sneeze. The equipment round here is so sophisticated that not only can it produce the studio set, it also produces props and makes them move. Now, I've just seen the rehearsal, very entertaining, but that Mark, he was doing some very odd moves. He looked quite mad. So I'm just going to go and find out what exactly he thinks he was up to. Uh, Mark, what are you doing? Oh, I'm uh, being a virtual actor now. 
Like a virtual actor, not a real actor. One that tries and doesn't get there? Virtually. <laughs> What's happening is these sensors, which are all over my body, mm -hmm. on my chest, on my back... <gasps> You're all you strapped in, aren't you? I am. These relay information to a computer in the gallery Ooh. and... Gee, these fat wires! Those <laughs> fat wires there. And when I move, the character that you can see on the screen he moves as well. He moves too. Yes. So how can you actually see what's going on in the living room? Glad you asked me. I've got a little 3D visor here. Yeah. I can see everything that's going on. The little microphone there picks up so do, all of my So do you sound. feel as if you're there now? I'm right there and I'm standing just by the fireplace, oh, just, just having a quick warm. Lovely and warm. Oh, that's better. Nice. Can you show me some more action then? Indeed. Stand over there. I'll give you a little dance, especially oh, for you. Oh, do your stuff. Take it away, boys. <laughs> Insane. Uh, excuse me. This is all very interesting, but I'm, I'm finding it a bit weird, a bit bizarre. It's very surreal. I think I'll make a swift, sharp exit now. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Bye. What was that? Email for Blue Peter, mate. All oh, right. Oh, what a groover. Do you think that's what our studio will be like one Virtually. day? Virtually. Oh. Oh, 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 it's all real, our studio. Solid, the real thing.